Hi there, it's Jay from Affiliate Resources, and today I'm going to show you a really easy way to find out what pages on your website are ranking for what keywords. And I'm going to show you how to do this inside Google Webmaster Tools. So they have something called uh, the Search Console, okay, I should say Search Analytics, and that's this thing right here. So what we're going to do is we're going to jump right in here. I'm going to go ahead and press click. Okay, so right off the bat, it's telling me these keywords I'm ranking for. Here's how many clicks. Now, not a, not a lot of data. There's no data there telling me um, what position these keywords I'm ranking for. So what we need to do is we need to activate them. So right here, impressions, CTR, and the one that we were looking for is position. So right here, we can see all the queries that we're ranked for. And this will show us how many clicks, how many impressions there are, and the average position that uh, our website is in. Now that's all great, and that's all fine and dandy, but I actually want to find out, I want, I want to be more specific. I actually want to find out which URLs on my site are ranking for what keywords. So what I have to do is I have to go and use this little filter system, which is absolutely fantastic. So all I need to do is click the pages filter. And now what's happened is it shows me all the URLs on the site and it shows me that, you know, it gives me the same data and it gives me the average position, but it doesn't give me any additional information about the, which keywords are being used. So here's what you do. So what I'm going to do is I will go ahead and pick, uh, we'll just pick the Dallas Cowboys one here. So I'm going to click on this double arrow. Now, as you can see, there's still nothing, but now look what's happened right here. Let me zoom in. You see here, it's now showing the URL there. So all I need to do now is go and click the queries filter. And it's now saying, hey, Jay, here are all the keywords that you're ranking for for that URL. So I can actually scroll down and I can see that this URL is ranking for all of these keywords. That's actually pretty funny, including Philadelphia Eagles. <laughs> so, and then I can verify this by looking at, so Dallas Cowboys snack helmet, average position 5.6. Now the reason why I say it's average position is because some places in the world it will rank differently. Okay, so if I actually click on this little icon right here, opens up a new tab for me, and we can see that we are ranking one, two, three, and four right here. So that's so as I said earlier, averagely, right? And there it is right there. So that's great. So we can close that down. And we can now if you want to check another page, you can just go and click here, this little arrow, and reset this filter. It goes reset. And then you can do it again. Go back to the pages, select a different URL, go back to the queries, you know, and there you can see there it says Green Bay Packers. Okay, and that's the URL that I selected. And now it shows me all the keywords that this one is ranking for. And once again, I can verify that by clicking on that little arrow button. And we can see uh, there it is right there, okay? So that's a really easy way to see which URLs are ranking for which keywords, okay? Uh, I hope you found this video informational, and uh, we'll see you next time. Bye for now.